Can you simplify the square root of 2 plus 3 over the square root of 8 minus 1 over the square root of 2? Well, can you? The first thing I would do is approach this 8 and try to get rid of the perfect square. Well, 8 is 4 times 2. So the square root of 8 becomes the square root of 4 times 2, which is 2 times the square root of 2. So substituting that into the original expression, this middle term, I end up with the square root of 2 plus 3 over 2 times the square root of 2 minus 1 over the square root of 2. Now I can rationalize each of these terms separately, but why? If I look at three halves, that's one and a half, uh, minus one, I end up with one half. So I end up with the square root of two plus one over two times the square root of two. Well, now I have to rationalize the denominator. And the way I do that is I multiply by 1. There are two things you can do in math without changing a number. Uh, one is to multiply by uh, 1. Don't change anything. And the other is to add 0. Uh, not as common. Multiplying by 1 in this form, the square root of 2 over the square root of 2 makes this a perfect square, uh, a, a, well, a square of a square root. And so that becomes 2 times this 2 becomes a 4. So we end up with the square root of 2 plus the square root of 2 over 4. Now, it's just a matter of adding 1 square root of 2 plus 1 fourth square root of 2, and we're left with 5 times the square root of 2 over 4. Well, thank you for watching, and I hope you consider subscribing. There are other things, uh, other problems, and I hope you enjoy them.